Good evening and welcome everyone to another video of mine and t tonight or this evening I would like to show you how to update Elements Ethics Core and uh, I, we, will, we will show the whole process from the start to the end and uh, we will use uh, Sarah client so that we don't have to remove a memory card from the computer. So now we start with uh, checking the core version of element. It is um, so as you may see the core version is 2024 2023 it means this core version comes from the 3rd of february 2024 and obviously obviously there is a new version which comes from 13th of january uh, 13th of february so now on the computer there is a from version from sec from 3rd of february and we will update it to the last version to the latest which comes from 13th february okay so let's get back and we will do it with esx dos as you know already magenta board is showing we are running on 20 megahertz let's press the nmi and run and run the sara client so that we can download new core uh, element yes Yes. So let's. I've got the core version comes from. Is is situated on on my notebook on my laptop here, so I have to. Uh, log into it. No. Yes. Yes. I want to reconnect. It is. Right, we're in. Okay, and the file we are looking for has a bit extension. It is this one. You see, we want to download it. Now we press NMI and set the correct directory to download. Is this one? Let's go back and download the file. Now we start downloading from my computer the new version. It, it is 1.7 megabytes. Let's actually we can we can measure it how many seconds it takes. Okay. So let's start. One, two, three. At the progress, you can see how fast ESX DOS is downloading. One seven, one point seven. Oh, it's ex extremely fast this time. You've got fifteen seconds. Oh, there's an error. Oh no! I don't like to see this error. I don't like to see it. It was too fast, maybe. So once more, one, two, three. Oh, it's heavily fast, I must say. I hope, I hope this time the demo will be fine. I can't believe it. Will be like twenty-five seconds or something. 
23 seconds oh 1.7 how much kilobyte is it per second divided 23 oh 73 kilobytes per second that's great oh I haven't reached that, that one never so we would we should have this file on our disk let's let's check it yes it is this one so we have to remove this one you can see here I've got there's a mistake there's an error there's a bug in the Sarah client I have to uh, rewrite the parsing the name name file name parsing I have to re uh, rewrite it okay we will remove it now how to remove it erase yeah now and now we rename we rename the new file it has to have correct name how to rename symbol shift and R okay symbol shift R fine now everything is prepared so that we for element core update so let's run the update program as you can see it did it has detected the file we downloaded now we have to press capital U for update so let's press it and after this has been done we will check the new core version if it was successfully updated but there was never a problem with that Okay, now we have to switch on and off. Okay. And now what is what is it saying? The FP, FPGA core is saying yes we successfully updated to a new core it's still February 24 but it comes from the 13th of February so now as you can see we have successfully updated the core so that's that was it using Sarah client so you may try it yourself anyway the update directly on the elements ethics is very convenient way Thank you for watching and see you by the next video.